Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. Today is Monday, I am literally just up and getting ready for uni. I am going to leave any minute now, I'm already slightly late so I've got to get a move on. But today is Monday, today is the first day of the week so I thought I would start a new vlog. I vlogged on Saturday which I'll insert the clips now because me, Anna, Haz and a bunch of other people all went to Sebastian's gig. So we all went there and that was super fun, really nice day and then we all came back and showed the ads. I didn't film anything after the gig but we had such a fun day so I'll insert that footage now. So now you're all caught up, I am currently on my way to uni. I haven't been to uni in the longest time, or at least it feels like, because we had a reading week last week. So like, last week I didn't go in. The week before I went in on like the first lecture that I had of the week. We only have three a week, and the two end ones I actually missed. I feel like I don't need to go in for this one as well, because it's basic video editing, and the lecturer sent an email out yesterday saying, if you know basic editing, then you don't need to attend. And little on me edits for like, a, that is my job. So like, I don't know why I'm going in, but I'm just gonna go in and get my attendance up because my attendance is slacking. So I'm gonna get that up and get that working better. So literally the only reason I'm going in is because my attendance is bad. So I wanna get my attendance back A1 again. And then, you know, I'm gonna come back and sleep because I am tired. Love that for me. looks awful. We also hit 10,000 subscribers on this channel which is insane. Like I literally made this channel when moving to uni just for my mum and dad to be able to watch. Like I didn't expect anyone else to watch it because my life, I feel like my life's not that interesting but obviously 10,000 people have subscribed which is incredible. So thank you so much if you subscribe to this channel or you like my vlogs or whatever. I genuinely love this channel so much. I've said it from the get go. But yeah that being said thank you so much for that. I am now on my way to uni like I mentioned. I don't know what the hell I'm going in for but here we are anyway. Living my best life. I'm tired. But let's do this. So it is a little while later now since I last vlogged. I vlogged walking into uni. I don't think I vlogged anything at uni. We basically had, it looked funny actually, we went in and like I said this morning, it were on basic video editing. Now like I said, my whole entire life basically revolves around editing videos. So I would just sat there like, hmm hmm hmm, tee hee hee. All the little things I had to do yeah. were import footage into Final Cut Pro and cut it off. I know, I talked about that yesterday. And I, I exactly do that in my sleep. Thing. I'm gonna insert the video that I made. Basically, we weren't meant to make a video. She was teaching us about how to like do audio and stuff and everything that she was teaching me was like, being like, I knew it all, but like I knew it all. So I just sat there and made this weird video. They get us some random ass stock footage. I'll insert the clips now what she showed us and what we created and this is my uh, final outcome. So can't wait for my tutor to see that. <laughs> Blowpipe into wet newspaper. <laughs> I am now back home as you can see. I just got back in. I am gonna do some uni work on my laptop. Me and Freya are having like a little working session. She's got a laptop right there. There's no need to hate. Just look at this. City for <laughs> Hi everyone, so it is a few hours later now. I, we actually are on the way to Westfields. Has has got work in literally like 10 minutes, so that's oh fun. Basically, I fell asleep. If you can't already tell by the look on my face, I yeah. feel like I look really... And he decided to tell us that his hand was in his pants when you he woke up. You walked in. Yeah. It weren't sexual, I think I was going to wee in my bed. You, I didn't see you put your hands in your trousers. No, my hands were still... When you... <laughs> You're gross. When you came in, my hand was still in my pants. And I just woke up. But then I needed a wee, like, I woke up, like, desperately needing a wee. So I think I was doing that thing where you dream about weeing, and then I were actually going to wee. So you kind of saved me from that. I don't know what the hell was happening in my dream. I was asleep for maybe, like, half an hour, but that... It's the current situation, if I hate to answer that. We are going to um, head to Westfields now. I'm going to, I don't even know why I'm going to Westfields, I don't actually need to. 
Full squad. Has where you are. Has us at work. I love that. <laughs> right, so this t shirt I'm gonna buy to do like a neon photo shoot. I'm gonna wear black dickies. This tucked in with the neon and night trainers that I'm also gonna buy. And then just return, but who said that? Not me. So, sister bought the t shirt. Love that for me. <laughs> Look who it is. You look like a brat stall. I love that. No. <laughs> Alright, we're in HM home because they actually have a store now and look how cool this bath is. I came in here yesterday with Haz, back again with Freya today. I didn't film anything yesterday though because Sis didn't have his camera. You know, I love that for us. It's so, so cute in here and I want to buy it all. what it is i literally think this is the only stuff they've got in this primark because i remember i'm not actually selling it um but look what they've got now sis look who it is Safi B. <laughs> you're so cringe why did you say it like that <laughs> Safi B. false alarm i think we might be onto something here look what it is me freya we're so dumb <laughs> I didn't see not. Yeah, I did not see it. We walked past it and everything. Wow, love that. If anyone wants to buy anything, here's your section system. Oh, shit. I don't know what you're giving that to me. Are you on? Tilts? She can't do staff purchases. Bro. You fucking damn ass bitch. Alright, so we're back from Westfields now. I'm going to do a little haul of what I actually bought. Now, this is all getting taken back literally tomorrow. So I'm not spending more money actually in actual facts because it's all going back. I just want to use this for a photo shoot. So this is the tea. So I got this like neon green t-shirt, which I think Haz is actually going to buy from me instead of me returning it. And then I also got these. These are so cool. I definitely would not be able to pull them off, so I'm not even going to try. But these are just some sick shoes, some neon green. Um, Nike Air Force, but they're really cool, like, it's got loads of writing on there and stuff, so I'm thinking, this t-shirt with these, I know it's not the same green, but I'm gonna edit it to make it the same green, and that's the tea, sisters. I look like a little schoolboy. why does my hair look like this? Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, so today I'm going to be talking to Jesus. Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. This is the same vlog, so welcome back to the vlog. I didn't film anything yesterday from what happened yesterday. Oh, basically my camera died after I showed you the shoes and stuff that I bought for the photo shoot. My camera actually died and I didn't put it on charge until like, I went to bed. So now I woke up to a fully charged battery, which is lovely. Um, I basically just ended up going to bed because it was literally like half past ten at night when I showed you that. So now... I'm in bed and I'm watching Jodie Shaw. I haven't watched Jodie Shaw in the longest time, but I was on Twitter last night and like an ad for it came up on my timeline and I watched like a teaser trailer thing and I was like, you know what? I actually miss watching Jodie Shaw. I used to watch it religiously every single Tuesday when it were on. I watched an episode yesterday and I watched an episode this morning and I'm just on the third one. This is like the newest one so far. So I'm halfway through that and then I am going to start the day. I'm going to start taking some photos and stuff. It's literally quarter past 12. I've been up since like half past 10, but I've literally just been laid in bed. I had my breakfast first and then just got back in bed to watch Jodie Show because today's my free day. Got a lot of stuff to do but I'm about to get it all done, don't worry, it's fine, it's all chill. I'm gonna finish watching this and then I'm actually gonna get my day started but I wanted to start my vlog whilst I was nice and cosy in bed, you know me. Cozy vibes. Hi sisters, welcome back to another episode of Hair Dressing with Byron. I don't think this is even a thing and I've lost the scissors. Um, I basically need a haircut as you can see. The top of my hair is getting quite long. I decided that I'm just gonna cut the top of my hair myself. Has meant to do it but she's at work. Here we go. I bet so many people are cringing at home at the fact that I'm just literally grabbing chunks like this and fully just cutting it off. This is like, do you know when little girls they go in their bedrooms and lock the door and then the mum comes in and it's like they've cut all the hair off? That's what I just am channeling right now, my inner younger girl. I know that sounds weird. My inner paedophile. I used to hate getting my hair cut because I was always scared of being bald and now I'm just like at a stage in my life where I just really don't give a fuck that much, you know? I'm gonna continue cutting my hair. I'm gonna do a little Instagram live video and then I shall see ya in a little bit. <laughs> so, as you can see, I am now bald. Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel or welcome back to this vlog because it's probably going to be in the vlog that I have already started filming that you're currently watching. Um, I am not in London anymore, as you can see I am back home in Sheffield, I came home yesterday. I didn't film anything yesterday because basically today is Saturday, yesterday was Friday obviously and I had uni 9 while 5 and then I had to get a train home at half past 9 but from like the time between 5 o'clock and 9 o'clock I had to go to Westfields, I had to get my 
like in a birthday present, I had to return some stuff. I just had a lot of shit to do and I needed to pack my suitcase, I needed to tidy my entire bedroom, I needed to do some washing, I just had a lot that I needed to get done before I actually left and then I had to leave an hour before my train because last time I missed my train I was like, you know what, I'm not even risking it so I left literally an hour and a half. Before I needed to get my train I sat in the station for 40 minutes because I was like, I cannot miss this train. I didn't get in until like half past one because obviously the train leaving at half past nine takes like three hours to get to Sheffield and then I had to change at Doncaster it was just long I just I just came home and got straight in bed basically but I'm in Sheffield now Ella has just texted me saying do I want to go over to Megan's house to drop her presents off because it's Megan's 20th birthday Megan and Ella are both 20 now which is so weird like they're actually not teenagers anymore I feel like I'm still like 16 I'm gonna stop rambling on about that I'm gonna actually get the day started I need to get dressed but my suitcase is downstairs so I need to go downstairs get my suitcase and then get ready for the day because I think Ella's on her way around to mine now and then we're gonna go to Megan's Alright, so this is really random and no one probably cares, but I just come to brush my teeth at my mum and dad's house and the toothpaste is pink. Like, this is the toothpaste they have and the actual, like, toothpaste is pink. Like, that is so cool. No one needed to know that and no one probably cares about that, but I started letting you know anyway. Oh my god, it's spicy toothpaste, what the hell? Just nearly got run over. <laughs> oh, they're presents for me! Oh, is that McDonald's for me on floor as well? Oh, Ella, that's so cute of you. I actually am putting that in, so. All right. If you do that, I'll report you to police as being a child molester. But you've got no proof that I am a child molester. Right, so in typical fashion, me and Ella are running late, as always, you know. I decided that I've left the card right until the last minute. So when Ella were outside my house, I'm like, you've not even wrote on card. And I'm like, oh, maybe I haven't. But yeah, I look homeless, as always. My hair's gross. And we're gonna go and wish Megan a happy birthday and take her a present. And that is all. Big zoo. We just went to KFC, ladies. I didn't film anything in Megan's because she was getting ready and we were like talking to her mum and stuff, so I didn't want to be like, hi. Ella's been telling me that KFC have actually changed the chips, so now it's a moment of truth. Are you ready? <gasps> they have! Yeah. This is the new KFC chip. <laughs> taste test. What's the It just tastes like old ones. Oh my god, Freya, it's a corgi. Two corgis. Does Freya like them? Freya loves them. Freya, this is I'm literally sure. purely just for you. Are they, they even like corgis? Posh dogs. Yeah, Freya went to private school. Mm. Oh, they are little corgis. Bye. See ya. Honestly, every time I pick up my camera, I look vile. Like, just look at me for one second. <laughs> it's getting really bad. I really should start caring more about my appearance when I'm vlogging. But here we are. Um, me and Ella have been watching YouTube videos for literally like hours and hours now. We should have watched the film, you know. Why did we not do that? Yeah. We've just been watching YouTube videos. We've decided now, at the grand time of 20 to 10 in the evening, we are going to go and drive to Costa and get a coffee. Mm -hmm. Ella's going to get, what are you even getting? Um, I think it's like a chocolate orange one, but I don't know. It's just what it's hot chocolate, is. right? Mm, I'm not too sure. I don't think it'll be a chocolate orange coffee. I think it'll be chocolate orange hot chocolate. Little on is gonna get a coffee, even though I should, probably shouldn't because you know, like, gonna sleep and stuff. So we're almost at Costa now, and I was just saying to Ella, Ella, was like, where's the speed camera on this road? And I went, I don't know. I don't know where my glasses are. Um, turns out they're on Ella's head. Don't really know that happened or when that happened. But she's like, oh, they're on my head, and I was just like. What? I actually look homeless. 
Do you do like a chocolate orange? Uh, um, no, drink? it's a chocolate. Yeah. yeah, can I have that, please? Um, a vanilla latte. Can I have a vanilla latte, please? Is that part of the order with the vanilla latte? Yeah, please. Yeah, yeah anything else? No, that's, that's it, thank you. Please, that a brand, please. Thanks, baby girl. Well, I don't know why I've asked a medium, because I just know they're going to say £6.30, please. Is that what it is? I don't know, I'm just guessing. I've got me change right there, Mom. Hello. Oh. I've just hold <laughs> it. Are they? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I bought that canal chocolate diabetes. Thank you. Ella, just give me one sec. I'm struggling here. I've got one hand. I'm just trying to be honest, but sometimes it's not good enough. Sorry about that. It's all right, thanks. It's all right, thanks. It's all right cutie patootie. I mean, I'm sure he watches your videos. Why? Because he just didn't take his eyes off you. I think we're kind of cute as well. Let's drive back around. <laughs> oh. Woo! Oh, 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 let's I, go back around. I'll wink. Ball. I'll go. I don't normally have to put coffee in my sugar. I mean, not that. <laughs> sugar in my coffee, but this is kind of strong. You normally have it with no sugars. And I just said that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind that. It's not great though, is it? I really expect it to be like, um, you know, Terry's chocolate orange. Imagine this. Oh. It's December 24th. You just got home. You live in a flat on your own and you've got a cat. But you're gonna go around to your parents' house tomorrow to celebrate Christmas and Christmas dinner. You just cracked yeah. open some after eights. You sit on a and get one of them. And, and you're watching Polar Express. I love that for After me. the film, you do a few lines to get you ready for Christmas morning. No, that's not my type of night, not gonna lie. I can't put this lid back on and I'm really scared. I'm gonna burn myself. <laughs> I'm just scared I'm gonna burn myself. Where should I put this stick? I don't know because I ate a litter in so don't check out a window. Do you know how damaging to planet that is? I actually think people think I'm being sarcastic when I say shit like that, but I genuinely am like trying to have a fun undertone on a serious subject, you know. <laughs> I can't stand littering. Ella back me up. <laughs> he can't stand it. <laughs> we'll put them like incense sticks in your car, we'll just stand them there so it tastes like coffee breath. <laughs> it smells like coffee breath in your car. Like when Used to come round here, the lady, and be like, "I ain't even finished your lunch." <laughs> Cause now she's had 16 coffees and a shit, couple of shit for breakfast. <laughs> Stinks like asshole. Nice quick asshole. Goodbye, darling. See you in the morning. Bye. Farewell.